My savage son Queen is about to put the whooping on Fujimaru and his crew. I am hyped for this episode, guys. If you couldn't tell by last episode, I am just, oh my goodness, I'm ecstatic. If you want to see my reaction to the very last episode, I will have that at the top right corner of your screen. But we are going to get into this as quickly as possible because I'm hyped. Whoa, 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 whoa. So what's this? Are they actually going to show Gilgamesh and Enkidu fighting? Like back in the day? Oh, we didn't deserve this. What? Where did this come from? Yo, are you already starting off with some? See, this is what I'm talking about when I say this anime is reaction worthy, even if you already played the game. Because yo, like what is this? That's hot. I'm loving this. Yo, what? We didn't get that in the game. And even if we did, I mean, that just looked awesome, bro. This man Gilgamesh is getting pestered. Pestered. But that's what it is like when you run a nation. Man. I will say this though, I mean, he's good at handling everybody. I'm wondering, where are we gonna actually get a new opening for this anime? I think it's gonna come next two episodes, I think? Because this is a two-core anime, and I know that normally whenever that's the case, we get another opening at about episode 13 onward. I don't think that this anime would keep the same exact opening throughout the entirety of this anime adaptation, just because there's, there's so much stuff that happens later that's so much different than what we're seeing right now to the point where I just feel like it really wouldn't make sense to keep this opening, you know what I mean? I mean, they already did change up the ending to closer match what's going on in the anime, so I just feel like it's naturally right that we do get in our opening. Let me know how you guys feel about that in the comment section down below. By the way, like these videos. I love that when you guys do that. Let me know that you guys are actually enjoying the reactions and or the episode, you know what I mean? Okay, so we're running through the forest. I thought they literally were right in front of her at the end of the last episode. I guess I'm remembering incorrectly. Golly, I'm hyped. Look at the way Ishtar is just running through. I ain't tell she's on screen. I just have to fully focus on her. Oh, Oh, here she is. Hi. I'm dead at the fact they put Ola instead of hi. She speaks English, Spanish, and Japanese throughout this anime adaptation. So I felt like that was kind of a misplaced with the translation and everything. It's like if she speaks Spanish, that's when you should put Spanish. And if she speaks English, that's when you should put the English. You know what I mean? I don't know. All right, so basically they have to destroy that thing that's behind her because that's the source of her power. That's the thing that justifies her divinity or something like that. I can't remember exactly. Oh my goodness. I didn't know that thing was heavy like that. She is really putting fear in their hearts just walking down so casually they're all shook oh my goodness here we go let's get it off rip she goes straight for the master now <laughs> i didn't expect it to actually fighting this i don't know why i just didn't but okay i'm for it cuckoo is so ruthless yeah and i'm not gonna lie she's not putting up with any of y'all bs he's literally just dancing on them man what the kick oh my she's just kicking everybody sitting them up out here i think this is going to be the part in the game where you had to make a decision and depending on your decision would determine how difficult the fight was going to be i can't remember the exact dialogue though but i think this is it if anyone knows let me know in the comment section down below oh my goodness here comes the smile all right i'm pretty sure that that was the decision so basically ritsuka was saying that he's not enjoying this fight i think that made the fight easier in the game oh no i can't remember guys i can't remember the exact stuff oh my goodness Goodness, I am so ready for her. Mosh, do something. <laughs> Yo, she just sent my fly. Here comes Anna. I'm not gonna hold you, Anna. I don't think that's really gonna do anything. Cause Kets is not rocking. Yo, two fingers? Who is she? Eisen? What? <laughs> Yo! I am for this. She is actually wrecking all of them. That man reason ago went and got her weapon to Oh, Ishtar? Ishtar, you missed. How you gonna call yourself an archer and miss? Do something. I need you to be great, Ishtar. You know, I hold you in high praises. You have to be great. Come on, baby girl. Look at this animation, bro. I know I say that almost every time that there's a fight. Not gonna lie, but this one is kinda hard to follow it sometimes, but it's still fluid at the end of the day. I'm liking this. Yo. She yo, what? No! No, I gotta play that back. No, what do you mean the stream you're watching camp? I have to play that back, son. I'm not rocking. No, 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 no. Bruh, Ishtar just got, oh my God. I don't even want to say because it hurts me to even admit what just happened. But Lord have mercy. Jaguar mine is finally pulled up. You're gonna have to do something because I'm not gonna lie. Everyone else is getting crushed. Even Ishtar got put down. Show me something, Jaguar man. Look at the star in her eyes. Basically, the plan is while all the other servants are distracting cats, he's just gonna run up there and destroy her thing that proves her to vanity and everything the simple and everything oh my goodness they aren't doing a good job though oh she at the same time she's enjoying this yo oh my god yo <laughs> did you really have to do that to jack Warner? i feel like if cats didn't enjoy fighting as much as she does she would not have put up with all this but this looks awesome bro regardless of uh, her reasons for still fighting oh my goodness the reversal 
I see you cats. I don't know how much I'll ever even be able to edit up this video to avoid copyright just because I'm enjoying every single mo Yo, what is she doing? Yo, she just grinded on her shield with her forearm? What was that? I don't know what to describe that as, but it was cool. Yo, those stairs must have been something else because it's evening. It was like daytime earlier, now it's literally evening. Don't tell me that's Ishtar getting sent. Oh my god, yo. Why is Kets literally <laughs> demolishing everybody? She's doing it effortlessly, bruh. Like, oh my goodness. They weren't lying when they said that she might just be the strongest goddess out there. At least right now, you know what I mean? Yo, did she just get... No, that's her presence. That's her presence right there. Okay. I was gonna say, what type of stuff? I wasn't expecting that. She doesn't simply want to see a victory. She wants to have a good battle, right? She wants to hit on battle for the soul. Yeah, see, I told you. Alright, so this is gonna be the moment. The thing. I pounded into her everything I've seen on this journey. It's just so crazy to me. It's like, yeah, that's some nice resolve, but this really doesn't make much sense to me, though. Like, why would he do this? So, she's about to send Mana over there? Yup. Okay. Bruh, this is the big moment. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I feel like they're going to animate this so well. Bruh, they are high as hell. Fujimaru is a crackhead. This man is a genuine crackhead. Now they're about to do this in the anime adaptation. It's throwing me off even more. This man literally is trying to take her down from the top rope. This is the determination of humanity. Bruh, if she doesn't catch you, you will die. I don't like that. They just transition so casually. Are they gonna at least show us something? <laughs> no, I don't like that. They gonna have to show us something. The impact of something. Why were you so reckless? That is a big mood. Look at his eyes. <laughs> He's like, bruh, I can't believe i just did that dumbass so basically he's saying now that he believed that she would actually catch him because of the fact she loves humans and everything she doesn't actually hate him and all she wants is a good fight and by showing her that he still trusted in her and everything she's deciding to leave the three guys alliance and whatnot the power of nakama and the power of love and the power of harem protag ex is something else huh oh jaguar mine is feeling some type of way now oh look at her she's crying i don't like this no oh my goodness but Kets just does not care the amount of utter fear in this girl face now roman is getting on ritsuka because roman told ritsuka to not do the nonsense that he just did that man really was one step away from just screwing up everything because he wanted to be insubordinate that's why we get to see sherlock i didn't think we didn't get to see sherlock oh my goodness but he's pointing out now that the previous grail war the one in 2004 was actually won by the head of county or the former head of county he's also pointing out the fact that he had himself an assistant that goes by the name of romani argument I was wondering how they were going to go about presenting this and everything. So basically, for the people that don't know this, you're supposed to be a little bit suspicious of Roman right now while playing through the Babylonia Singularity if you're playing the game and everything. I felt like they needed to find a way to address that while in this Singularity. So they just did that right here. Okay, this is nice because I know a lot of people were complaining about this as well. The flashback into when Maj actually asked Roman a question at the beginning of this series. See, they actually cut that out, but they're touching on it now and that's good. That was basically basically Maz trying to test Roman and everything and clearly he passed because they're still happy and they're saying you know what like he's still a cool guy I guess even if he's hiding something he's still straight in our heart I think we're going to have another moment with um uh, Ishtar quote unquote oh the pout that was so cute and oh my goodness that's so cute <laughs> long story short they're basically just bonding right now Ritsuka you're getting slumped my guy you did the proper correct thing right there my friends I just love this oh my gosh I know I keep saying it but it's just so proud Precious. Anyone who's played the game, you guys can relate. This is just a wonderful moment. I can't say what I want to say right here. I can't because spoilers. I cannot. Y'all know why. Anyone who's played the game and everything. I'm gonna be spoiling the anime only, man, so I can't say anything. I'm not doing it yet. My man says hype the next morning, though. I mean, I would be the same way after sleeping with Ishtar, quote unquote. Even Ishtar without the quote. Yo, Sidiri, what's going on? Yo, I love Sidiri so much. I wish that we got to see more of her in this anime adaptation, but oh my goodness. I can't really remember. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember now. I remember now. I know what happened. I think there's something at the end of this episode, though, because it looks like, yeah, I was ready to say, there looks like there's some extra fluff at the end of this, so we're not done yet, guys. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, so my man's just waking up. This man wakes up the same way every single time <laughs> from his chair. Now he's sitting there in the underworld. Crazy, he literally had his chair in the underworld as well. And he goes back to just chilling. That's just so crazy. I seem to have woken from my nap, and the depths occur. This man just does not care. This is no time for just... <laughs> All right, nah, he does care. All right. <laughs> yeah. So basically, Google Mesh is dead, guys. <laughs> I love that. I love this anime adaptation. Oh my goodness. What did you guys think about that episode? Anyone who actually watched the episode through and through? How you guys feel about the reaction? Are you guys matching my energy? Are you guys enjoying this as much as I am? If you are, make sure to let me know in the comment section down below. Make sure to leave a like. Oh my goodness, though. Let me just say this, just to conclude my thoughts on that episode. 
That fight with Ketz was just, oh my gosh, it was just disrespectful. My girl Ketz was literally disrespecting everyone while beating them up. It's not even just a matter of beating them up. She literally was disrespecting them in the process. Laughing at them, sitting on them, just, just doing whatever she wanted. She used two fingers to negate Ana. Like, oh my goodness. But something I do want to point out, the fact that Ritsuka did not destroy her symbol of divinity, she still is being blessed with divinity and everything. So it's actually a good thing that he did his crazy ass crackhead stunt that he did because, I mean, now he has a stronger ally than what he possibly could have had. So that was like a Hail Mary. That was literally a Hail Mary because if she didn't catch him yeah he's dead that means that humanity is just <laughs> is gone but that is going to be everything that I do have to say on this episode I hope you all enjoyed it as said before if you did enjoy it make sure to leave a like comment down below how you felt about it also make sure to subscribe to the channel the discord is always in the description down below you guys just gotta go ahead and hit the link I mean it'll take you right there the door is always open you don't even have to knock it's right there man just walk in we welcome you with open arms but that is it guys hope you have a wonderful day peace Thank you.